the allegations of drug abuse against the presidential candidates of APC. Ashwaju Bola Tinumbu have stirred mixed reactions among people. In a statement made by or made during an interview with Chinese TV on Wednesday night, Festus Kayamu explained the alleged suit against Tinubu. According to the APC spokesperson, Ashiwaju was not a defendant in the drug case and as such wasn't indicted as claimed by people. Kayamu explained accounts in his name were used, not him. When asked about the number of accounts by Chinese Tele, Vision correspondent Kayamu revealed that there were 10 accounts in three parts. Kayamu explained that Tinubu took responsibility for all the accounts because they were all Tinubu's family members and his companies. Kayamu's statement goes, Ashwaji was not a defendant in the drug case. It was accounts in his name that were sued. He took responsibility for all the accounts because his family and companies were all there. They pleaded with him not to come against them if his accounts were wrongly seized and it is contained in paragraph 6, page of 2 of the settlement signed by the lawyers. According to Kayamu, Tinubu was the one telling the lawyers to go and see no more because his accounts were wrongly seized. <laughs> Nigerian people, when I hear what this man the Yansu, so his family members, they are the ones. So that means his family, they are into all these things. You see, you see why this country will never move forward. If we continue to have these people at the end of our face, the defending nonsense. In the recent, with this, in evil, is it not a, one, a, one of these uh, politicians in the UK, the Home Office uh, Secretary or so, she mistakenly used a, a personal email address to send an official official mail or vice versa but her personal whatever was involved she just resigned only that one or another one. people go say she, yeah you okay just this because uh, because of this small thing now make it come they resign i yes to just apologize and go finish for them even nigeria said they never even apologize they go say hey wait till they say she commits offense you know be mistake she make now on you reach wait they, they say keep her simple because they because of that congo they resign if not Nigeria, you know, go even apologize. Safe, you know, go even apologize. Nada, even people, people go even say, say oh, This will not even be anything. You know, there are some things that will happen. Nigeria will begin to raise alarm. Say, No, we are not supposed to do that. But with this kind of thing, Nigeria will say, and they will say, I beg, I beg, this will not be matter. But with that, the man, the woman resigned. Not to talk of this kind, every, every this thing. So I thought they said they, they were framing them up. It was not a, it was not an issue or it was a non issue. You can imagine. So they are even agree to the fact that yes, it's happened. He called it they call it twist. Huh? Oh my goodness. Shame on you. All of you who are supporting. Shame on you. So his family members' names were the ones that were there. Oh God. I don't even know what to say. I'm even speechless. Even while going through this. I'm even speechless. This guy is a disgrace to his people and the legal profession. No wonder. The Northern Cabas, they wrote him that you are a disappointment. You know, there were a lot of things that, that he said he you know they wrote today that he did this is part of the reasons why people should say that this man is a disgrace indeed a disgrace ah, ah. can you imagine Kiyamu is a disgrace indeed <laughs> can you imagine talk with the they come out for person mad no reasonable people should associate with this type of person is audaciously shameless and repulsive Kiyamu is really sick now wow was not him but account in his name hmm. i fear account in his name political news speak we get one saying show me your friends and i will tell you who you are hmm. don't forget that kayamu is a lawyer he had educated us that forfeiture is not criminal in nature just go there steal as many as you can then forfeit little to kayamu government then go and sin no more it is very illogical for any educated man to agree with Kayamu on that point. Many corrupt individuals who had served under last administration forfeited many properties to his government through court. Many are still in various in courts. She engboro, she oronie, she engboro orolenu orolenu edie, she oronie. Lord, ni ni borwenu. 
you can't even be in APC and not be a criminal or accomplice of criminal. Hmm. He has destroyed his name in Nigeria politics. His generation will not be given a position because of this nonsense he is doing. He thinks uh, Nigeria of before. He will shock you. You are the highest madman that has ever been created. Can you imagine defense? Tinubu, the law, huh? So the lawyers go and see no more. Very funny. Couldn't even stop laughing over our comments, over your comments, honestly. Can you imagine that he said, go and see no more. They use his name. All his family members' name. They were there. Somebody wants to use your... Are they into... All of them are into drugs. So they, they will not use... Why did they not use Ekeyamu's name or other people's name if they are not involved in this whole thing? Hi. Now, oh, wow. Ah. No one that Tinubu they run. If they run, you know one face me there. They go they they defend nonsense. Say it does not matter. He wants to meet with the real people. He's just going about uh, uh, organizing his own debate. Can you imagine? He knows that the, he cannot answer, he can't face the public and answer questions. But he don't go feel deny him. He don't go feel escape him. That is all I know. He cannot escape it. Can you imagine what uh, this man is letting us know? That it doesn't matter. Can you imagine? <laughs> that you told them see no more since uh, all the names in the account were his family members name shame on all of them kai the worst thing that can happen to a woman is to defend truth as lie you will keep twisting your tongue until it bleeds because your teeth definitely is not even accepting the lies ipc kayamu and ffk they are assigned the worst position in the apc presidential campaign it's unfortunate that you of all people will denigrate or degenerate to this level mr kiyamu you are shameless and a big illiterate can you listen to yourself kiyamu it was a cat bearing his name that were sued not him it is now obvious that your sponsor to the law school really wasted his money on you account in his name who owns those accounts how did this this man became a son so Kiyamu is also high on cocaine, like the drug lord Tinumbu. I pity you, Kiyamu. This is why you hear we are, uh, we are trying to market an expired product. Hmm. Kiyamu, what kind of a lawyer are you? Senior advocate of a nicotine. If a kidnapping ransom is paid to my account, who am I? Your account should be arrested because you're innocent, according to senior advocate Kiyamu. They'll just go and arrest your account. <laughs> hey, my goodness. What is he really trying to say? How can an account in somebody's name be sued? I don't understand this one. Can someone explain this to me? This shows that Sinumbu is actually a drug dealer. It's quite unfortunate. He is. We can say it because they have confirmed it. He have, they have, he, 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 he can, people are telling him, come out and defend yourself. I think it will be as called him out now. Oh, God. They, in fact, they won't call that one head. Say, why he go talk like that? Those, that is why he's so related with it. He's so, you know, used to all this like bureau of a thing. Huh? Completely insane. Tinubu takes responsibility of all the accounts, yet he is not responsible to the illicit drugs money going into it. Has it been these allegations involved? One of the opposition candidates, Kayamu, would have long applied as a prosecutor. This is what supporting APC can do to you. Imagine how hard this one is trying to defend crime. I have told people several times. All this I say, hey, Tinubu no fit. Hey, Tinubu is nowhere. Tinubu. I say, for God, those are small Tinu. Compared to all these uh, baggages that this man has been carrying. Forget they say he know, he know where. If you know where, you go take drugs now. They go treat you now. See, they talk. Or you, 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 when you take medicine, you take drugs, they treat you, you rest. You, before you know, mama tak pong pong, you, you, you bounce back. So all those are saying no fit. All those are not saying what the Nigerians are supposed to be saying. These are. This is one of the bad gadgets I was talking about. That I'm not even too keen. Not that it's not important, but I'm not too clearly keen about that he's not fit, he's not too, he's this and that. He's dragging. It goes beyond that. It's part of it too. But the main thing, no one like, he carry brilliant vanna and they will defend it. He himself, he said it. Is your money missing? Eh? Is it not my money? Oh my God. Unfortunately, I don't want to just say, you know, to generalize, but all of you who are supporting him, shame on you. Shame on you. What I know, if God says yes, nobody can say no. No God, 
No, God is saying no or yes in this matter. You are just a foolish person. <laughs> okay, oh. in a civilized climb, Tinubu and Atiku can't even contest presidential election. That money was forfeited and not paid as tax. For you to forfeit such large sum of money remains means that you are buying your freedom. Festus cannot deceive us. This Keyamu or Bomoyamu, the loss. Hmm. So guys, let's say your opinion and have your team because this is insane, crazy.